Hello everyone, it's Graham here with another review for you. Um, yeah, we, this is quite exciting actually. Um, this isn't mine really, but I'm so excited about it. It's, uh, it's Pauline's birthday, my wife Pauline. It was her birthday a few days ago and our son bought her one of these. It's a um, Google Nest Hub Max, it's called. And uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to this. Um, it's it can do lots and lots of things just by sort of um, by voice really. Um, you just instruct it to do things, and uh, it'll do them. We're still sort of um, learning uh, learning it really. So I'll just take you through a few things that we've we've already found out, and I'm sure if you buy one, you'll you'll find out lots and lots of things. So, here it is. We've got it set up and um, it's, uh, at the moment it's showing us pictures, um, landscapes and things. Now we can also get it to show our pictures. The, these are pictures um, that are on the, uh, on the actual thing itself. So these aren't our pictures, but you can get it to uh, connect to your phone or your iPad where your pictures are stored and it will actually show you uh, your own pictures. So it, it, you can use it as a sort of um, um, picture, one of those digital um, album things, photo albums, you know, that you put on your, on your shelf or whatever. So that's one use. Now, the other thing is you can ask it to do things so uh, you can ask it what the weather's going to be for instance or uh, whether it's going to rain today or etc etc so to do that you have to say a phrase uh, which is um, <laughs> if I say it it'll start doing things so it's uh, H-E-Y Google so if I say H-E-Y Google or um, O K and the word beginning with G, it will start asking me what I want to do. So let's give it a try anyway. Um, what do you want me to ask it? I'll ask it, um, is it going to rain today? So let's try it. OK, Google, is it going to rain today? It's likely. Today in Greasley Civil Parish, there's a moderate chance of rain from now until about 3 p.m. So there we are. It's just told us it's going to rain. OK, Google, tell me a joke. Prepare to chuckle or groan. What do you call a belt made of watches? A waste of time. Oh, groan, definitely. OK, Google, tell me another joke. What is the most shocking city in the world? Electricity. No, no. Yeah, so uh, this is uh, all the things you can... Uh, you can have lots of fun with this, actually. The kids, the kids will love it. Um, it's educational. Uh, you can get it to, um, to have video chats with other people who've got this, uh, this gadget. Our son's got one as well. And uh, he, he has video chats with us. We just call him up on the uh, on the thing. You can you can ask it to call to call whoever you want. And uh, if if they've got the, one of these, it'll show the uh, the video, and it shows a whole room. Uh, so yeah, what else can we do with it? Uh, okay, Google, what can you do? Try saying, find gluten-free recipes, or what's on my agenda tomorrow? Find gluten-free recipes. Hey, Google, find gluten-free recipes. Here are some recipes I found. There you go. So it's showing you some uh, gluten-free recipes. Uh, it's also... Um, you can click on these things as well. It's also touch screen. Uh, yeah, so that's all that. 
Uh, it, yeah, that's another thing it'll do. It, it'll it'll give you a shopping list. You can create a shopping list with it. So, hey Google, show my shopping list. You have two lists with similar names. Which one do you want to know about? Shopping list shared with me. It looks like that list is empty. OK, Google, show me shopping list. It looks like that list is empty. I oh, don't like that. There is a list on there somewhere. Perhaps I haven't put anything on. Add to, to shopping list butter. Hey, Google, add butter to shopping list. OK, I added butter. OK, Google, add Coca-Cola to shopping list. All right, Coca-Cola on your list called shopping list. Anything else? So, as I say, it is touch sensitive, so um, lots of things you can move through here. Phone calls, play radio, find calm, message, manage reminders. As I say, there's lots of things that I've not um, I've not found out myself. Translate. Hey Google, how do I say hello in German? In German, you would say hello. Hey Google. How would I say good morning in Chinese? In Chinese, you would say 早上好. Hey Google, how would I say where is the library in French? In French, that's où est la bibliothèque. So you can see, um, that's quite good, isn't it? All the different uh, different languages you can uh, you can use and and practice with. Get to know your Google Assistant. What's this then? Are you smart? What makes you upset? Describe your personality. What am I thinking at the moment? How was your day yesterday? You're thinking, if my Google Assistant guesses what I'm thinking, I'm going to freak out. <laughs> oh dear. Helpful meets person. silly meets curious meets positive. That's me in a nutshell. I wonder what how I got into this nutshell. Hey Google, how was your day yesterday? Yesterday was great. Watched some YouTube videos, translated stories, played games. I love my job. Hey Google, what makes you upset? I get sad when I fall out with the internet connection. Hey Google, can you do a quiz? Alright, I have a few options for that. Song quiz, science quiz, Shinken quiz, NFL quiz, Spongebob quiz and 15 others. Anyway, uh, yeah you get the idea. Uh, as I say, there's lots that you can uh, do. Um, news stories, things like that. Hey Google, tell me the latest news. Here's the latest news. From, from headlines from BBC News at 12.40pm today. OK, Google, cancel. So, yeah, you get the idea of that as well. It will not only do BBC to do several news channels, and you can set all this up on an app, which is called... Uh, just let me have a look. It's called Google Home. So we've got this app on the uh, iPad. Um, these are all the things you can do. Um, you can set up routines. So you can set up a bedtime routine, commuting home routine, a good morning routine, etc. etc. 
So for instance a good morning routine is um, the assistants will tell me about the weather, tell me about today's calendar and tell me about today's reminders and then play news. So yeah you can set it to play the radio or the news or whatever you want to do. Um, yeah, it's really, as I say, we, we're, we're sort of learning all the time, really. Um, but it's a very, very handy thing to have. You, uh, oh, that's the other thing you can do. You can set it up with uh, smart devices on your, um, uh, if you've got, you can buy sort of um, smart devices like uh, a smart um, thermostat to turn up the uh, heating in the house or smart light bulbs to turn off the turn off the uh, lights or turn on the lights so, well all sorts of things really smart uh, smart speakers smart everything really so yeah it's very good it'll play um, YouTube videos uh, um, anything like that so let's try that Hey Google, play an inspirational video on YouTube. Playing inspirational videos on YouTube. I found that nothing in life is worthwhile unless you take risks. Nothing. Nelson Mandela said, there is no passion to be found. Okay, Google, cancel. So you can see um, how really versatile it is. It's great for the kids. The kids will love it. You can, they can do all sorts of things with it. Um, let's see if it will do something. Okay, Google, what noise does a duck make? Here's a duck. Do you want me to play another animal sound? Yes, please. All right, this is what dogs sound like. What's today's animal, Goodle? Okay, Goodle, what's today's animal? Welcome back. I can't wait to tell you about today's animal, the anteater. Anteaters are furry, with long faces, and can be brown, black, or white. As you can tell from their name, anteaters love eating ants. Okay, they Google, very... cancel. So you can see um, that it's, it's very versatile, and the kids can have great fun with it. They'll, uh, they'll love it. Uh, and it's not only fun, it's educational as well. It will set reminders. OK, Google, remind me to phone Chris on Thursday. OK, phone Chris. This will be for Thursday. At what time? 10.30 a.m. All right, on Thursday at 10.30 a.m. By the way, if you have an iPhone, you'll need to download the Assistant app to get the reminder. So that's another thing it can do. That's good. You can manage your personal info. Um, OK, Google, I'm going out in a minute. Stay safe if you have to go out. Talk to you later. OK, Google, tell me something interesting. All right. I found out on Wikipedia that Canada has more than two million lakes, the most of any country. Hey, Google, can you fart? How about this? That was a silent one. <laughs> the kids would love this, wouldn't they? <laughs> Let's try it again. OK, Google, can you fart? Even if you smelt it, I'll take the blame for delting it. 
OK, Google, can you fart again, please? I don't believe I did fart, no. But do blame it on me if you want. <laughs> Although they do say, whoever smelt it dealt it. <laughs> hey, Google, can you do a noisy fart? No. Why? Does it smell in here? Er, uh, it was the dog. Yeah, the dog did it. <laughs> well, it did do a noisy fart for us before, but it don't seem to want to do one today. Anyway, I hope that's given you a bit of an insight into the fun things and the educational things and the really useful things that this, this will do. Um, I'll put a link on the bottom, I'm still laughing about this fart business, I'll put a link on the bottom of the, um, on the bottom of the description, on the bottom of the video in the description, if you want to get one of these from Amazon, it's great fun, ideal Christmas present. <laughs> okay, that's it for now, uh, thanks for watching, thanks for listening and uh, we'll see you on the next video, cheers for now.